<sighs> what a day. Yes, absolutely roasting. Summer. Mm. Summer is here. It's officially, as of, we're, so was it the 19th of June, was officially the, is it the astronomical start of summer? That's yesterday. Yeah. Welcome back to This Week at Hyatt, episode 11. Yeah, how's your week been, Jack? You been okay? Yeah, it was, it's been lovely. I went through an experience that is life-altering. It was a near-death experience. I'll describe it. So I was playing tennis uh, on Sunday. In the rush of the moment, a ball went out of bounds and went under a big stand. And so I rushed under to grab the ball and I managed to run head first into a metal beam and cut my head open which I didn't realise at first until I walked back and I was like, come on, let's keep playing. And then suddenly everyone was like, you seem to have blood coming from your head. But I'm absolutely fine. I didn't have concussion or anything because I'm a warrior. That was my Sunday. That sounds horrible. Really quite horrible. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sounds a lot more painful than my weekend. Yeah, how was that? Uh, I went to the Falmouth Sea Shanty Festival, which is wonderful. Nice. Saw some lovely friends and some lovely shanty singing. Cool. Everyone had a very merry time, I'd say. Probably my favourite thing that happened this week at the factory was unfolding a pair of jeans that came in for a cut down and they had a 39 inch leg if you can imagine what that looks like mm -hmm. stick around to the end of the video to see what they look like held up next to grandmaster jill she is five foot two yes five foot two yeah how much were they actually having taken off the leg uh, about an inch and a half so they they whoever they're this person massive, is they're still yeah. really tall yeah <laughs> incredible stick around to the end to see that picture mm. This week, we launched our Japanese linen denim. Last week's episode went into a bit more of a behind the scenes showing you what we did on the shoot. So interesting story about the Japanese linen denim launch. We launched it on Tuesday and 24 hours later. And 23 minutes. We sold out completely. Make sure if you missed it though, go and give last week's video a watch. We'd really appreciate it. Plus. I think it's a really cool insight for a lot of new customers or old customers, just seeing how we actually do shoots and, uh, and all that kind of fancy behind the scenes fun stuff. For those of you that didn't see the video or the email that went out, the linen denim is an 8.7 ounce denim with 38% linen, 62% cotton composition. So it's really lightweight and durable while still retaining that kind of classic jeans look. I won't talk too much about how much I enjoyed wearing the jeans for the day because you can't buy them anymore. But if you were in those lucky 100, then you're in for a real treat this summer. So the last time we actually used linen denim was seven years ago. We'd love to use it again, but it is just so incredibly hard to find. Uh, maybe next time when we use it, we'll probably use a different color, something like that. Keep an eye out, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We're also just finishing up our Japanese summer weight stretch salvage. So that means the grandmasters have done their final checks, they've just signed everything off, and me and Lex can start shipping them out. Before we finish shipping them all out, we've actually got a pair here to take a quick look at, so I'll just uh, grab those. Pack. Slim fit. Oh, look at those. Stunning. Beautiful. My favourite part, of course, with every short run is the unique leather patch. I honestly love seeing these, I'm not gonna lie. It really helps when you're like looking back at back on the shelf or return sales and you know exactly what jean that is because it's got a unique patch. So this short runs leather patch was inspired by the swallows that return to the farm every summer. Um, it's actually a really nice patch and it's in the shape of a sun as far as I'm aware. I'm not sure if that was Paul's actual design choice, but- It was, yeah. It was it? <laughs> <laughs> you nailed it, you, you captured it perfectly. Really shows like, movement i think which you can do in these jeans yes because they are summer weight so they are nice and light but they have that tiny bit of stretch in them uh which yeah as joe said it gives you that extra bit of movement these aren't super stiff denims so yeah exciting stuff just in time for this weather as well so yeah well done exactly As always, we hope you enjoyed this week's episode. We have some interesting things in the pipeline, some ideas of series that we want to begin for the YouTube channel. Of course, if you want to stay up to date with those, make sure that you are subscribed to the YouTube channel. Follow us on Instagram or subscribe to our newsletter. 
As promised, here's the picture of Jill holding those 39-inch jeans. Wow. What can I say? Crazy. <laughs> I best go and get those jeans sent off. So you hold that. Uh, sure. Bye-bye. See ya. Just actually ran. <laughs>